Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be showing you the process for adjusting the limit switches on the PowerWinch P92001 electric lift. This winch is commonly found on most pop-up campers from 2015 to present with the Goshen lift system. The limit switch assembly will require periodic adjustment to ensure that the camper's roof opens and closes fully and that it stops before overcranking occurs. If you find that your camper's door suddenly doesn't fit after raising the roof all the way, you may need to adjust your limit switches. All right, let's get started. Okay, let's go over the tools that we need. First, we're gonna have our screw gun with a square bit. Second tool is gonna be our limit switch adjustment tool. This tool is normally found in the brochure folder that comes with the trailer. If you don't have one of these, you can use 532nds Allen wrench. All right, step one is gonna to be to remove all four corner latches from the top. Next, we're going to move to the front winch cover and remove the four screws holding it in place. Now that the screws are out, we're going to be taking the winch cover and removing it. I'm hanging it off to the side like this. You will see the limit switch assembly located right here. This is what we're going to be working with. Next, we're going to be raising the trailer approximately 10 to 12 inches. Next, we're going to be taking our adjustment tool and placing it in the red Allen slot here. You'll note that there's a plus sign with an arrow indicating which way is the increase and which way is the decrease in the time it will run. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is decrease the run time with this red Allen screw until the switch just clicks, just like that. This is gonna be our base to start fine tuning the lower limit switch. Now we are going to go back and increase the time. I usually do a few turns at a time and then check the switch. You'll notice that it'll briefly work and stop again. You need to repeat this process until your roof is fully down but the winch cable is still taut. That should be it for the lower limit switch. Now we are going to raise the trailer about 80% of the way and work on the upper limit switch. With the roof raised about 80%, we're going to take the adjustment tool again, move over to the white Allen screw, do the same thing. We're going to decrease it until the switch just clicks to get our base, and then we're going to increase a few turns at a time and slowly bring it up until our guide wire is just straight but not taut. A little too much. So just like that, like I said, not taut, just straighten out. 
And that's pretty much all you need. With the limit switch adjustment complete, it's a good idea now to go and check that your door fits before buttoning everything back up. We're going to replace the cap, put the four screws back in, and that should be it. All right, everybody, that's the process for adjusting the limit switches. I'm Michael from JNM RV Rentals. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you. Bye bye.